Hey, welcome to the lab. I'm Marty the OT Guy. Some of you might know me from the video series we've done over the last couple of years for Nozomi Networks, where I've been coming out as uh, Marty the OT Guy, powered by Nozomi Networks. Well, this is an introduction video to something new for 2024, where Marty Lab will be time spent in my lab doing things that aren't really work-related. So instead of, like I say, powered by Nozomi Networks, this one's more like Marty the OT guy powered by energy drinks and copious amounts of sugar instead. And we're going to take a look at interesting things that don't necessarily relate to what I do in my day job with Nozomi. We're going to start that off um, with a series of videos. We're actually going to rip a PLC apart. Well, not a PLC as such. It's an RTU. It's a remote telemetry unit. But we're going to tear it apart, take a look inside it, and see what components are there and see if we can work out what the architecture is and it's going to be this one here it says a uh, it's a kingfisher um, this is a kingfisher rtu and we're going to spend four or five sessions in videos as we pull each component of it to pieces take a look at the circuit board see what's on there see what we can work out just uh, with some basic hand tools um, and a bit of googling and see what we can go from there Further on in the year, um, some of you might have seen recently, I was making some noise because I bought a flipper. Hey, um, yeah, it's cool. Let's take a look at what we can do with that as well. And I know there's plenty of videos out there all over the internet about what to do with flipper and, and how to pull PLCs apart and things like that. But um, maybe I can put a bit of a unique twist on it with the, the career that I've had um, and the things that I do. So yeah, hopefully you'll stick around. Um, first videos... <laughs> These aren't going to be made on a timeline because I'm making them in my own time. So it's Sunday afternoon here um, and I'm putting this together. So it's going to depend on my free time and, and what we're doing. But um, keep an eye out because the videos for the Kingfisher um, rip and disassembly will start coming through soon. And hopefully you'll find it interesting. See ya.